So boom, a couple of days before, my auntie told me, late night now, you shut my mouth, kick me out of her. I was like, what? You tripping? Can't be me. <sighs> Guess what I did? I get a f up out of there. And I got me a new crib. So let me show you around. <laughs> Yo, but Gamma, what are you doing, yo? Are oh, you working with MTV today? Okay, alright, alright. Are you following me? Are you following me? Yo, so what is up, MTV? This is Kimmy Sadboy, and here you are in my mansion house, my condo on the hill. Look at the view. Look at the view. Look at. Look at the view. Look at the view. Look at the view. Wow. So boom, here we are in the living room. Big couch, big TV. Couch so comfortable I can fall asleep in it. <laughs> but just know, if your girl ever comes here, I will have her like this. Oh wow. Bomb But gamma. That's not the best part of the saloon, no. The best part of the saloon is the view. Look at this. Wow. Bon, y'all follow me to the master bedroom. Oh my gosh. Yo, that bed comfortable, no? So here is my big bedroom with my big king-size bed. Wow. But kill me, sad boy. Why do you have a king-size bed? Because kill me, sad boy, is a king! <laughs> so boom! Here we have my little EBD shower slash toilet, you know. For the people who want to know, they can fit two people. So boom! Here we have the kitchen. One of my favorite spots in the house, my big oven. I'm going to be cooking some macaroni and cheese, some noodles, Vienna sausage, uh, Jamaican patty that will put yours, some frozen pizza. I'm a whole chef. And you'll see my fridge. I got my favorite juices there, and that's it. It's really empty. So here is my favorite place, part of the house. My studio, the place where I will be screaming in front of a camera. Look at the logo, look at the logo. So here is the Mind Your Business Boulevard, the Stay Out of My Business Studio. Y'all can see the sign on top. So anytime somebody enters your it can be for a video, a live, a stream. Don't forget to mind your business. Because you too are cool. That's it. Man. I feel like y'all uh, was too long in my house now. Too long in my house. So I, I, I guess y'all need to get. Get up. Last info before you go for the grimy ones that think here is an easy lay. I will have one camera that come in in two days. Dio in the back of you and one inside. So who want to try the lock? Try the lock. But as soon as you step one foot inside, you will teleport directly to the Lord. Directly to the heaven gates. And the video will be a proof of why I sent you to the Father upstairs. So Y'all chillax. I know, I know Christmas coming soon, but I'm not Santa Claus. Here is not a free take for all. No, 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 no. I know a lot of people will ask me, but sad boy, how much it costs to live in a place like this? And I will tell them the plain truth. A lot, but the peace of mind is priceless. And to function properly and faster, you need to eliminate all the distractions, all the situations, the people, the hurdles that are holding you back. In no cap, as a man, you need to learn how to walk away, to stand on your own. Because living by your parents till a certain age is overdue. At the point, you need to move out, you know. Personally, I work hard every day for my independence, my freedom. If you work hard to buy a Tima, Gorgian, couple Lacos, and that's it, 
that's on you stay over here one thing I would advise everybody is to advance in life. If you got heritage, claim it. If you got a empty house under your name, rent it. Find a way to make a profit. If you live at your mama's house, find a way to move out in your own place. If you walk in and catch in the bus every day, find a way to pass your card, pass your license, and buy a car. Find a solution for all your problems and stop complaining. That's my advice. I just never complain. I just do the work. Everybody is on their own journey and everybody is living their life at their own pace. The most important thing is to not study the next man because as soon as you do pay attention to the next man, you stop advancing because you're not focusing on the next step you're supposed to take. And that's the issue with a lot of people. Another thing, as a man, you should never tolerate disrespect. Why let somebody disrespect you? If they're not better than you, or they have nothing more than you. If you love yourself, you don't let people disrespect. Sometimes it's good to be wrong and strong. A lot of people tolerate bullshit from others because they want to save money. Because they love that person. A lot of people tolerate anything because they, they can't do it differently. They don't have no other options. And that's a lie. But every problem, you can find a solution. Find a way to get out of this situation. Find a way to get out ASAP. Saving money is not better than a piece of mind. Saving money is not better than having privacy. Saving money is not better than taking risks to pursue your dreams. Y'all see my everyday view? And I still look bummy now. And I still look bum. I'm a real bum. But it just proves y'all that anything is possible. You just have to believe in yourself. And anybody can do it. Even a bummy would like me. So stop doubting yourself and stop staying in situations that you are not comfortable are you not happy in? Life is too short to be miserable every day. Life is too short to be unhappy every day. Find a way to your happiness right now. Far from the end goal, just take one step and another step and another step. And by the time you will reach, if you enjoy this video, positive reactions, likes, don't forget to subscribe. I need to hit 10k on YouTube and I will start making more YouTube videos, you know? Because I like making YouTube videos a little bit more than them Facebook videos, I really like. And I will start doing some live, some stream, so y'all get in tune with that. And that's it, huh? subscribe to your boy. I want 100 likes on that one, if that's possible. If not, well, that's life, huh? That's life, that's life. I'm gone.